Good to see you again, Sister Leliana. Thank you, Sir Meron. The revered mother runs the Chantry itself, and Sir Bryant heads the Templars stationed here. Were? Did you drive them off? Well, Sir Bryant will appreciate that. Not since Terran Loghain passed by with his army. It's a shame about the king. But with the Darkspawn coming, few can think of anything else. Make her watch over you. Now's better than... Darkspawn Are you here to see the Reverend Mother too? The head of this Chantry? She's very busy, but I think she's free now. I came to ask for a blessing. With my family abandoning the farm to flee north, we'll need all the grace the Maker can offer. Well, good luck to you. I need to get underway. If I'm lucky, I'll make it back to the farm hold by nightfall. We are the only hope of protection this village has now, and I will not abandon them. That Yes, my lady? Who might you be? I see. I am Sir Bryant, commander of the Lothering Templars. Tan Loghain declared all Grey Wardens traitors responsible for the King's death. You know this, I hope. I don't believe the Grey Wardens would be as careless or malicious as the Tan claims. But either way, there it is. It is best you not linger, though. Just in case. Maker's breath, how many times must we drive them off? All of them? By yourself? It's true. I saw it from my post. It was over so fast, we didn't even have time to get over there. Sad that it needed to come to that. But then they asked for it. Will you accept a small reward for your service? If it interests you, there is a Chanter's board outside, full of quests that need doing. The Chanters even offer pay for some of them. Now, unless there's something else you need. They are. With the Ban having taken his men north, the village is left to its fate. We will evacuate as many as we can before the Horde reaches us. I will stay as long as I am needed. Now, unless there's something else you need. If the matter is important, certainly. The revered mother leads this flock. I merely command her Templars. Normally, our role is to protect the Chantry and seek out unsanctioned magic. For now, it is all we can do to protect the innocent. Let us pretend that I was such a mage. What would you do to me? Hmm? Oh, I have no time to even think about such things right now. My concern is protecting these people. I see nothing threatening them other than the Darkspawn. We have more than swords at our disposal. We're taught to dispel unholy magics as well. If only our powers work to keep away the Darkspawn. Alas, it is not so. In her study, no doubt. Preparing what she will take when we eventually evacuate. Our ban was summoned by Tan Loghain and he took his soldiers north with him. Lothering has been abandoned. If the matter is important, Certainly. Other than the Darkspawn Horde bearing down on us, none of it is good. Teon Loghain is set to declare himself king, I hear. Disaster piled on disaster. Teon Loghain has no legitimate claim on the throne. He may be a hero, and his daughter may be queen, but he is a commoner, and the king's corpse is barely cold. If Arl Eamon was able to intervene, perhaps it would not have gone this far. I do not care who takes the throne. Only fools fight over who owns a cottage while it burns down around them. Arl Eamon has fallen ill, and his knights are on a quest for the sacred urn filled with Andraste's ashes, said to cure any malady. He must be very ill if they chase miracles as the only cure. One of the Arl's knights, Sir Donal, is here searching for fantasies while... Never mind. Ask him if you care about this foolishness. I cannot openly help you, I fear, but here, take this key. It opens the large cabinet on the far wall. 
There is more there than we can carry when we evacuate, so take what you need. If the matter is important, certainly. Only if you are interested in the business of mages. I have heard word that the Templars who watch over the Circle of Magi's Tower have called for the right of annulment. Hopefully I've heard wrong. To have such a call when mages are needed to fight the Darkspawn, something terrible must have happened. I have nothing else to tell you. The only news I care about is the approaching Horde. Travel safely, and may the Maker watch over you. You, miss, what is your name? You seem quite odd to me. You would not be the first to think so, but avert your eyes. I will not have you staring over long. Let's get used to it. I'll be watching you. We want no trouble here. As if we needed more fighting here. Don't you see how scared everyone is? Who? I beg your pardon. I did not see you approach. Sir Donald? Is that you? Alistair? By the Maker, how are you? I, I was certain you were dead. Not yet. No thanks to turn Loghain. If Arl Eamon were well, he'd set Loghain straight soon enough. So you're here looking for the Urn of Sacred Ashes, then? I am indeed. Andraste's ashes are said to cure any illness. But I fear we are chasing a fable. With each day, my hope dims. What? And you have his locket? And a note? Maker's mercy. Thank you for giving me these. I would never have known otherwise. Thank you. I wonder how many of us have met similar fates on this mad quest. My mission takes priority. But I fear I shall be returning to Redcliffe with nothing to show for my efforts. Why is that, if I may ask? I see. The Arl is a popular man, it's true. Tern Loghain, however, is a hero throughout Ferelden. Whatever the Tern has done or not done, the Arl remains ill, or worse. That is my primary concern. The Arl fell ill before the King died. But what if Loghain planned that too? Oh, such thoughts do not sit well with me. We should see what's happening in Redcliffe ourselves. I believe that now more than ever. If nothing else, I am certain you would be welcomed at Castle Redcliffe. The Arlesser is there, and she could tell you more than I could. I expect you to take advantage of the Chantry's library, in fact. But my skills are better suited to battle than chasing down tales. Supposedly, the urn contains the ashes of the Prophetess Andraste. Surely you know all this. If you're truly interested, there are books here containing a great deal of lore. Nothing I have found leads me to believe that this was anything more than a quest of desperation. With Henrik gone, I need to return to Redcliffe. Perhaps later I will seek out the scholar his note mentions. But I must go. Thank you again, my lady. You have been most helpful. Maker spoke. Chant of light scattered in the dark. Not like Miss of Andraste. I'll get on it. Maybe she was ugly. Maybe she had bucked it. Cry out from the shadows. How would you know? Allow me. I could do that for you. Yes, of course. Let him hear our unwavering faith. Let him hear our righteous dedication and enduring perseverance. And then shall the Maker return to us. Yes? What can I do for you? I knew this time would come. I should have listened to my sister. Sure, sign the paper, she said. You'll enjoy some coin now, but they'll be back. I guess I'll see you on the front lines. Let all mankind be humble. Let all repeat the chant of life. Only the word is spelled in the darkness. Good day, Sister Liliana. I'm surprised to see you're still in Lothering. 
It is good to see you as well, your reverence. I do not recognize your companion. Greetings. Will you be making a donation to the Chantry? Our need has never been greater. Might I suggest 30 silver? Thank you, dear woman. What can I do for you then? A Grey Warden? Here? Oh dear. You put me in a difficult position. You must know that Tern Loghain declared the Grey Wardens to be outlaws. Tern Loghain? That is as hard for me to believe as his condemnation of the Wardens. There is a price on your head. Lay low and I promise to keep your presence a secret. That is the best I can do. Now, if there is nothing else... I cannot help you without risking the safety of this village enchantry. The best I can do is keep your presence a secret. I am sorry. Now, if there is nothing else... For a Grey Warden? Yes, you have a difficult road to walk, don't you? In Andraste's name, I call upon the Maker to watch over his child and creation. Watch over her path, O Maker. Give her light in darkness. So let it be. Now, if there is nothing else, may the Maker guard you, Grey Warden. Who have sinned be forgiven. Now's better than later. Tell me something, Morrigan. Did you live there in that forest your entire life? I left it on occasion, but I always returned. Why? Is that so strange? It was my home. But it was just you and your mother there? No one else? Mother occasionally had company. What? Company? Do I even want to ask? No, you really don't. How dare you accuse me of thievery? I saw you take the supplies from my car. Your grassland eyes are inept. A chastened would never stoop to petty theft. You marsh folk are all thieves and liars. Enough! People here are already desperate and frightened. They don't need you two coming to blows. But what about my food? I said enough! The forest failed to protect us. Our gods deserted us. There's no protection here, either. The carnage we left in the wilds was horrifying. Shokke basit hisra, marade starit, merade twasit, abana kyun, maras shokra, anane sam kyun. You want one of my captors? I will not amuse you any more than I have the other humans. Leave me in peace. I'm in a cage, am I not? I've been placed here by the Chantry. The revered mother said he slaughtered an entire family, even the children. It is as she says. I am Sten of the Beresad, the vanguard of the Kunari peoples. You mock me, or you show manners I have not come to expect in your lands. Though it matters little now, I will die soon enough. This is a proud and powerful creature, trapped as prey for the Darkspawn. If you cannot see a use for him, I suggest releasing him for Mercy's sake alone. Mercy? I wouldn't have expected that from you. I would also suggest that Alistair take his place in the cage. Yes, that's what I would have expected. I suggest you leave me to my fate. No 
doubt. What help do you seek? The Blight. Are you a Grey Warden, then? Surprising. My people have heard legends of the Grey Warden's strength and skill. Though I suppose not every legend is true. Perhaps if you told her the Grey Wardens need my assistance, it seems as likely to bring my death as waiting here. Farewell, then. To be left here to starve? Or to be taken by the Darkspawn? No one deserves that. Not even a murderer. Yes? What can I do for you now? It might have been kinder to execute him, but I leave his fate to the Maker. Why does he interest you? Then his next victims might count you and me as their murderers. on this, Liliana. You know your friend better than I. These are unusual times, Your Reverence. With us, the Kunari might do some good. I am sure of it, in fact. Were things not so desperate? Very well, I trust you. Take these keys to his cage and make her watch over you. Thank you, Your Reverence. Your trust is not misplaced. I'll get on it. Why do you always go on about how stupid I am? I'm not stupid, am I? If you need to ask the question... Because it hurts my manly feelings, you know. Or one of them. Then I'll be sure to write you an apology once all of this is over. I was educated by the Chantry. I studied history. They don't make stupid Templars. Then I must have been mistaken. I'm very impressed. No, you're not. You're not even listening to me. My, you are smarter than you look after all. Your Chantry must have been very proud. You wish something more of me. I confess, I did not think the priestess would part with it. So be it. Set me free and I will follow you against the Blight. And so it is done. I will follow you into battle. In doing so, I shall find my atonement. May we proceed. I am eager to be elsewhere. Oh, blast it. Yes.
suppose you're looking to buy something. All right, just don't buy everything up. Allow me. I could do that for you. As you like. We done heard what was said. You're a warden. I don't know if you killed King Kalen, and make her forgive me, I don't care. But that bounty on your head could feed a lot of hungry bellies. Attack!
Got it. Something is coming. Ladder, so you can get off my back. Got it. I'll get on it.
Let him take notice and shine upon thee, for thou hast done his work this day. Huh. Don't suppose you're looking to buy something. All right, 